Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve question number third of exercise 12.1, and the first three parts are: you have to find the value of this part, this expression, and this expression, and let's find what should be the value of this. We know that some raised something raised to power zero is one plus this is uh, one raised to power. Four, and this is two raised to power two. Further solving this, this we can take the LCM. This is four plus one raised to power two raised to power two, and this is equals to five upon four, and this is equals to four. So this and four can be cancel out. So our answer should be equals to five. Now. Let's find what should be the answer for the second part. We know that whenever, uh, okay, uh, first of all, this is two, this is four. Let make the base equal. So this is two raised to power minus one, and this four can be written as two raised to power two minus one, and this is divided with two raised to power minus two. We know that two raised to power two means two multiplied by two is four, so four can be written as this, and this is two raised to power minus one multiplied by this is. These power can be multiplied. This would be minus two, and this would be two raised to power minus two. Again, now the base are same, and these are multiplying. Uh, these are multiplying each other. So we know that whenever the base are same, the power is added, and this will be remain as it is. This plus minus is minus, so this will be two raised to power minus three is divided by two raised to power minus two. Now again, the base are same, and here it is divided. So we know that whenever the base is same, and we have to divide it. What we have to do is we have to subtract the powers. Okay, we have to subtract this minus this power, which is minus two. So this will be equals to two raised to power minus three. Minus minus will become two, and this will be two raised to power. This is minus one, and this can be written as one by two. So this should be the answer. Because we know that whenever the power is in negative, if you want to convert this into positive, shift this to the denominator. Now let's find the answer for this. This is again a question for exponents, and this I have already told in the previous videos that whenever the fraction is there and the power is in negative, well, uh, you have if you want to convert this into positive, you just have to reciprocal this decimal. So this will be become two upon one raised to power two. The negative power will become positive. Again, this will become three by one raised to power two, and again this will become four upon one raised to power two. So this is nothing but two raised to power two plus three raised to power two plus four raised to power two. This is four. This is nine, and this is sixteen. So 16 plus 4 is 20 plus 9 is 29. So that should be the answer for this particular exponent. So this is how we can solve these parts. In the next video, we are solve we will solve the rest of the parts. Thank you.